hi guys thanks for joining me again if you're new to my channel welcome 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 my name is Anne, and on my channel i review foreign international content today i'm back to review this wonderful series it's called cho young the star is born and oh so wonderful and for my american friends this is on hulu and i guess to the rest of the world it's on disney plus not sure why it's not showing on disney plus here but it's it is what it is i guess but i'm here to review episode five and six and oh this show just keep getting better and better and better and i like i keep saying when they do those scenes where they're doing the play you really as a viewer forget that you are watching a show and feel like you are in a theater watching this play going on they are so mesmerizing and captivating they really pull you in and oh like i said this role for kim terry it's it's a good one uh, she's gonna win awards like i said but oh so episode five was interesting to see young seo obviously gets embarrassed because cho young happens to hear her being chastised by her mother and we know young seo is so looking for the mother's approval you know we know her older sister is her mother's you know uh, jewel right my first daughter is this she sings opera she's this she's that always bragging up about her first daughter and she just wants that same acceptance from her mom when she saw that Joyan heard she gets so mad and tries to take it out on her and I love how Joyan was like look <laughs> almost like you think you got mother problems I got mother problems too okay please don't take it out on me first of all and then second of all um, don't try to say that your mother has not helped you in anything because the reason why you go to school without any worries or anything like that is because your mother provides for you. She goes, do you know other girls in the school or in the troop have to work? I mean, that's the reason why her other friend was working in the coffee shop. That's why she helped her friend and that's how she got kicked out of the troop, right? So I thought that was interesting. But that being said, I love the relationship between Cho Young and Young Seo because although they're rivals, I love that their rivalry is pushing them to be better. Like it's sharpening. They're sharpening each other. They're like really pushing each other. And for that, I, I appreciate it. And it's good to see how their relationship is slowly evolving and it's kind of warming up to the point where at one point, uh, Young Seo helps Cho Young, right? So that was interesting. And then obviously we see because she got kicked out of the troop, she has to sing. She signed that contract only now to realize that if she wants out, the guy is like, um, you're gonna have to pay damages because they want her to sing, but they only want her to sing all nice and pretty. When she starts to sing as herself, they're like, no, 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 no. You know, like, no, that's too much. And they all freak out, which is very sexist, if you will. Um, but anywho, she wanted to leave and that guy was like no you can't leave you signed a contract which by the way we find out he is the one who reported her to the trip director so that he can have her to come sing for him because he knows about her mother he finally gets to know who her mother really was because this guy had all her pictures he heard her sing when they were, were kids i guess when he was younger so he knows who she is when she saw pictures that they took of her in the village, of her mother in the village, she was like, why would you take pictures of my mother? I thought you're only going to get shots of the village. Only to find out the reason why he wants her is because he's hoping that if she becomes a star, her mother will come back into the music business. And I was like, oh, not good at all. So let's just say it doesn't go very well. Her only saving grace becomes when Joran goes to the director and tells her the truth finally and say, look, uh, Cho Young was trying to help me to work at that coffee shop. And the reason why was because I'm working because I have to send money home. My sister is sick with uh, tuberculosis, right? And so when the director heard that, she was like, wow. So he, she comes back to get uh Cho Young and it, just in the nick of time because the director is like you can't leave you're gonna have to pay damages for your contract and the way the director was like I'll pay it was like oh 
okay, I love her so much. And then obviously takes her back to the troop, which was so much fun to watch. It's crazy because it's like the girls, the ones who don't like her even also missed her and they were so happy to see her. It's almost like it's lively again. They love her that she's in that troop. And it's just interesting that now she's picking a role. She picked a small role as a soldier. But I loved that scene where she goes to do research, you know. I love how she always goes to like, let me see what, a, you know, how do a soldier look like, act like. I gotta be manly about it and act like a man because, you know, I'm a girl. And when she met that military guy who talked about the war, it really brought back her PTSD of how she lost her dad. And even in episode six, we see how she's acting but it's getting to her head, right? Even the director was like, uh, Young, you need to get out of your head, right? You, she could tell like, you're doing too much. She's going off script and that does not help. And even at the end there, we saw where she sees the military guy in the crowd and it brings her right back to that time when she lost her dad at war. And it's almost like she's having PTSD on stage. And then the way she starts to sing and then freezes. And then now the audience is egging her on like, uh, you've got to say something, you got to sing, you got to do something. And then she starts to sing and it's something that is off script. All the other actors are like, what is going on? And you can tell the director is not happy at all, but also at the same time, so touching oh i love this show so much it is just fantastic uh, i'm loving how it's evolving and i can't wait because you can tell she's gonna end up being obviously the star but i love her journey the, the fact that we're there to see her starting from you know low all the way obviously um by episode 12 we know she's gonna be a humongous star and i just love how real she is and how she you know it just the way she just you know, the way it's written, this script is really, really well done. But, oh, have, did you watch episode five and six? What did you think? Just a really fantastic series. I'm loving everything, the acting, the music, the, the way it's written. The, whoever wrote this script, you're a genius. It is really, really well done. Anyway, join me next week as I review episode seven and eight. Give me a like if you do like my video. Subscribe, and I'll see you next week. Do see.